Hey guys, welcome to the Hollaby Homestead. Hey guys, so um, this is going to be episode one of working on this trailer, which we're going to work on over time. It'll probably be a year or two before it's completely done, but this is episode one and I've had mouse traps in there for a couple of days. I've got the door open actually, hoping that if any ones are still alive in there, they'll just run out of there. And uh, I'm going to start off with cleaning the trailer out and uh, getting it prepped for some work. So here we go. I've got uh, got one of these masks, um, just to protect me from mouse poop. And I got some gloves. Let's do this. So I don't hear anything in the trailer. I think if there were mice, they're gone now. Um, anybody who knows me knows I'm ridiculously terrified of mice, which is so stupid, because I know they can't really hurt you. So I'm just going to face my fears, put on my gloves, get my bag, and get started here. <laughs> Isn't it funny some of the things that we're scared of? Okay guys, so I got most of the debris cleaned out, but I need a broom and for some reason I can't find a broom anywhere, even though I'm pretty sure we got about five of them. But anyways, I'll give you a tour. Um, just keep in mind, almost everything's getting fixed, replaced, whatever, and I still haven't cleaned out all the fine debris, so uh, just keep that in mind. Okay, so first of all, I think we need a little step here. Um, that's a mouse trap there, by the way, if you're wondering what that is. And that table leg does work. I just, uh, knocked it when I was cleaning. So there's a little sitting area here. I was able to get the windows open, which is nice. So we got the kitchen here. There's a view of the uh, living room again. Got a nice mirror there. Hey guys. And in here is a pretty decent bathroom. You know, for the age of this thing, right? So that's gonna be replaced. Over here, that's a closet to hang clothes. Got shelves here. Now, there is a soft spot right here, which uh, we're gonna have to fix. It's not too bad though right now. And obviously, you'd have to replace this stove thing. And finally, back here, we got a couch here that folds out to a single bed and we got a double bed over here. So if you're wondering what we're going to do, I'm going to first of all rip up this carpeting that's here and over there. Um, vacuum the heck out of everything. Uh, put down new flooring, obviously after we fix that soft spot there and paint the walls and the ceiling and probably do some cool backsplash in the kitchen here and uh i'll reupholster the uh the couch fabric i might actually you know the more i think about it with this space i think it might be a little bit nicer if there was if this was all ripped out 
And there was like just a couch and a chair and a coffee table, but the door just slammed closed because of the wind. But uh, we'll see. I'm just uh, kind of doing a preliminary uh, clean out. Um, open that door back up. It's quite windy today, folks. And I got these windows open. They are the biggest pain in the butt to open and close, but that's okay. Probably will fix that somehow. So anyways, guys, that's the uh, tour of the trailer. So once we uh, fix it up, I'm going to, uh, we're going to put it in the back field. It's going to be a really cool little cabin for like a guest house or like a, um, uh, you know, even we would stay out there because it's near the woods and uh, it won't look anything like it does now. It's in pretty sad shape right now, but everything is fixable, right? Well, guys, that uh, concludes episode one of Trailer Reno. Just cleaning it out, I know. Um, so next... Uh, it'll probably be more of a thorough clean and start ripping stuff out. And uh, and then we'll go from there and see what we need. But mainly uh, the flooring and the walls are going to be painted. Um, well, sorry, the walls are going to be painted. The flooring is going to be replaced. Um, anyways, guys, I'm pretty excited about this. Uh, I know it's an old trailer and it seems really daunting. I'm kind of daunted by it, but I think it's going to be worth the... Uh, little bit of elbow grease is going to take to fix it up. <laughs> Anyways, guys, we'll see you next time on episode two.